On day four of the Legion State Tournament, Ashland Post 77 took on Lawrence on Tuesday, July 30th to try to earn a spot in the final day of the tournament. It was a 1-0 Post 77 lead until the top of the fourth. Manaya deals. There's a bunt. There it is. Throw to third. It's going to get away. And here comes a run. Alex Amalfi heading home. It's 2-0 Post 77. Another error for the pitcher. The long drive. And this is up the left side, right to the third baseman. Throw to first. It's going to be off the mark. And here comes another post-77 run. All kinds of defensive issues for Lawrence. And another run right behind him. Two will score. It's a 4 nothing ball game. It's a partisan crowd here. It's a partisan crowd. The 2-2. Hornung gets a piece of this up the left side. That's a fair ball. The third baseman didn't even move. One run is in. 5 0 post 77. An RBI single for Jackson Hornung. Kevin oh. Balowitz scores. Brennan Grover up to third. This is up the left side. Slow roller, and the shortstop can't pick it up, and the run is going to score. It's 6 0 post 77. What the heck? Five runs scored in the inning, making it a 6-0 lead at the time. Post-77 never looked back as they took the game 14-6 and improved to 3-1 and in the States. After a rainout Wednesday, the final day was Thursday, August 1st, and the first game put Post-77 against Sandwich in the state semifinals. Top of the first inning, Post-77 got on the board. Better tuning in, and I know they're in by the thousands. Met some today, actually, Tom. We'll talk to you later on in the game about that. Kavanaugh gets a piece of this one. Left side could be trouble, and that's going to drop in front of the left fielder. Hornung is heading to third. He's going to be waved around. Here he comes. The throw in is cut off, and it's one nothing post 77. An RBI double for Dom Kavanaugh. He gives a Mookie bet shake out there at, se at second base. <laughs> I don't know. These kids see stuff on TV and they gotta, you know, imitate. The terrific pitching of Luke Gustafson provided little pressure on Post 77's defense. Top of the fourth inning, Post 77 played it another run. To deal, Farrell at third. Gets a piece of this one, takes a couple hops, picked up by Coleman, throw to first off the mark, and the run scores. 2 0 Post 77. Good hustle. An errant throw by the shortstop. Allows Farrell to score the second run of the day. Post 77 got on the board once again in the top of the fifth. Sean Jewett over one and was hit by a pitch. Puts this one up the middle in his center field. It goes. Hornung being waved around here. He comes to try to score. The throw is cut off by the pitcher. And it's 3 0 post 77. An RBI single for Sean Jewett. Ashland took the game 3 0. Luke Gustafson went the distance, giving up no runs on five hits and struck out four. A couple hours later, it was time for the state championship versus Lawrence. It was a straight out pitcher's duel between Miguel Matos and Alex Amalfi. The only runs of the game came in the top of the fourth from Lawrence. Lawrence hung on for the two to nothing win. Ashland Post 77's tremendous season came to an end with 21 wins and 5 losses. Congratulations to head coach Jake Obed on an absolutely amazing first year at the helm and all the Post 77 players for bringing Ashland to Legion Baseball further than they have ever gone before. Everyone in the Post 77 organization should be extremely proud of what they accomplished.